In this video, we'll show you how to create product configurations on the Viper 4. So first of all, we need to navigate to our product configuration tab by touching on the product configuration. From here, we'll hit the plus sign to create a new product configuration. For this demonstration, we'll put in, we're going to do a corn post application. And then we can check the box. And from here, we're going to choose a mix name, which we'll hit the plus button. And we'll also call this corn post. From here, we'll leave it as a volume. We'll have it displayed as corn. Our carrier type will be water. We can select that from the drop down menu. And our carrier volume total on this machine is 1600 gallons. From here, I can add my chemicals in. I can do that by clicking the plus button on the bottom. You're gonna see here some of our favorite products that we've used in the past. If you've selected those, they'll show up in this list. Uh, if they're not in the list, you can hit the plus on the bottom and we can start adding our chemicals. The first one we'll add will be Callisto. We can go ahead and select from the drop down uh, which product we're picking. And then we can green arrow back. From here, if there's a registration code, it will show here. You can either enter a custom one or you can select none. And then here we're gonna put in the amount of gallons of product we're going to use in that 1600 gallon tank. So for Callisto, we'll put in six gallons. The next product, we'll add a second product in here. And that one we'll use uh, one of the ones we've used in the past. We'll grab Stinger and we'll add that to our mix. And we'll put that in at three gallons to the acre and then we'll add one more product and we'll add that as also not in our list so we'll add it as a favorite and that product name will be smoke I can select that from the list back arrow back again we'll select none on the registration and we'll put that in at 2.5 gallons per tank mix. Well, once I have that set, I can green arrow back, and now you can see here on the screen I have a corn post product configuration. Uh, you can continue to add these different types of product configurations for all your different applications that you may do. Also, if you want to come in and make an edit to that corn post, you can make sure you're selected on corn post. I can come to the pencil and paper, do an edit. Uh, for example, for this next round, we don't want to have, we're going to remove the smoke from our product configuration, but what we do want to do is we want to add a third chemical, and for this, we'll go ahead and add Roundup Power Max. We'll back out, and we want to add that in as 20 gallons per tank load, and now my corn post has been updated to my new product mix. Again, you can edit each of those, or you can simply go ahead and create a new product configuration for each of those different sprayer types that you may be doing.